Right, so what I've found is the bike's running fine once you first start it up on the choke. But as soon as it warms up, it's then cutting out. So I think the jets are blocked. Now it's been stood for 18, 19 years. So let's have a look. What condition the jets are in? I bet they're going to be blocked. Look at that. I'd say there's a good chance that's completely crudded up. There you go. That's what's sitting in the carb. All that lovely gum. Okay, there we go. We've cleaned it up a bit. It's not immaculate. It's clean enough. We've got most of the crud off. That's looking a lot better. Clean up the float. So what we're going to do now. These jets. These two jets are blocked. So I've seen a video where obviously the jet inside there is tiny but you put a, a very thin guitar string down it. And look enough, I've got a guitar string so I'm going to put it down there and just clean out the jets and then we can try it. It's looking a lot better. Right, so this little jet I've managed to get this guitar string through. It's coming out that side. Now that wouldn't go through, it was completely blocked. So now, I just need to rub it like you do a towel up your ass crack when you get out the bath just to clean it up a bit. So it just shows you 18 years crud what it can do. There we go. Stripped, cleaned to a degree. All the jets have been cleaned out. It's nice and clean. All clean. Those were blocked up. The jets. That tiny one there. That's the one I've had to put the guitar string through it to clean it. Let's get it on the bike. Right. So we've cleaned up the carb, it's all nice and clean. We're going to put it back on. All that needs cleaning, but I don't want to blast it and get anything in the inlet. So I'm going to fit the carb on and then we'll degrease all of that and clean it. Let's see if it starts.
<laughs> it's going. Seems a lot better. I've seen other carb spleens. Superb. Oh, I'm chuffed at that. At least now I know the carbs done. The carbs all working. I just now need to sort the air uh, filter. Let it warm up. See if the choke kicks in. And then all we got to do the weekend. You strip the back wheel, clean the back brakes. And then we should be ready to try it on the road. There we go. The choke's now off and it's still running. Kushti kushti. There's a homemade air filter made out of a pair of toys, double layered. That should hold it in place. There we go.